Hi, I'm Julien Viau from Michel Roland Lab. I'm uh, agronomist, a wine consultant, and um, and one of uh, Michel's uh, efficient working partner. And I would like to give you a few words about the 2019 vintage. As a good story, everything started during the winter, and the, the winter was one of the wettest we had for the last 30 years, uh, which is very, very important uh, for the water stock refilling and uh, to supply uh, the water all along the growing season. Mm, the bud burst started quite early, uh, which is always stressful for the owners and for the vineyard manager due to the risk of frost during, during the spring. Uh, but uh, fortunately, in 2019, there was no damage of frost, not big, of course. Um, spring and summer was quite uh, hot and dry, and, and the bloom stage uh, took place during a very nice week uh, under very good weather condition, very sunny, very windy, especially for the earliest terroir of of the region in Pomol in top terroir of Saint Emilion on the best crest of uh, Medoc. Um, spring and summer was quite hot and dry, and without uh, too many uh, heat waves, uh, so there was no sunburst, there was no damage due to the to the high temperature. Uh, the problem came from the water because we didn't have too many water during during the summer uh, because the water came from the lot of thunder showers giving a huge quantity of water but in a very very short time which is not efficient to go into the soil and, and refill the stock uh, so it means at the end of the summer we had quite huge hydric stress especially on the on the more gravelly and sandy terra in the region. Mm. The variation uh, took place quite early and in a very short time, which is very good for, for the quality because we have a very good homogeneity, which is very, very important. Um, at the end, the harvest started quite early, especially for the white wines. Um, we started uh, to pick the white uh, in the region of Pesac Léonion, uh, beginning of September, we started with the uh, Sauvignon Blanc, Sauvignon Gris, and just after we continued with the Sémillon to keep the, the freshness, to keep the fruitiness and, and the elegance. Um, right after that, we continue with the Merlot on the, the earliest part of, of the region in, in on the plateau of Pomol, on the top crest of uh, Poyac, uh, Saint Julien, and Margot, and then Saint Estep, of course. Um, the harvest was very interesting because uh, uh, we split the harvest in, in two stages. Uh, because at the end of September, we had uh, a rainfall. So at the end, we have two styles two style of wine. Uh, before before the rain, we have a very concentrate, uh, uh, ripe wines uh, with a lot of roundness, with powerful and, and density. And after the rainfall, we have another style with more, let's say, elegance, uh, means uh, less powerful, uh, with more balance, with um, maybe a bit more length. And, for wine blender, as we are, it's very interesting, interesting because uh, it's like a, a painter. We have a, a scheme of uh, flavor, of style, of tannins, so of density, and, and we can create a very, very interesting blend and very complex blend. Um, so in conclusion, 2019 is very interesting vintage, very fruity, very aromatic, um, with a good roundness, with smooth tannins, with elegance, with a good freshness, giving a good length to the 
to the blend and I hope you can you are going to try it and I hope you are going to enjoy it. Cheers.